Urban Gardening Thailand. Join me in my tropical Asian garden. It's the end of May here in Thailand, and that means it's rambutan season. I just got these rambutans harvested directly from the tree. They're super fresh. I'm going to eat them and grow the seeds. Rambutans are easy to open, and the red spikes are soft and harmless. Cutting open the rambutan reveals the white, fleshy part of the fruit that you eat. It is juicy and sweet. Yum! The seeds are sort of almond-shaped, and they are about 1 inch, 2.5 centimeters in length. I chose the largest seeds to germinate. Wash off all the sweet, white, fleshy part to prevent mold or fungus from growing on the seeds and to discourage ants if placing the seeds directly in soil. To make this more fun and interesting, I decided to try four different germination methods. The first method I used was the moist paper towel method. Place your seeds in an airtight, watertight, and lightproof container and store above 77 degrees Fahrenheit, 25 degrees Celsius. I read that it was best to germinate seeds planted in soil with the flat side down. This sounded a bit like superstition to me, so I decided to test it out. Though I am only using three seeds per method, so granted it is not much of a scientific experiment. It is also a bit difficult to determine which side is the flat side and which is the round side, but I did my best. In this pot I have placed three seeds flat side down. I'll cover them with about half an inch of soil, about one centimeter. I am using normal potting soil for all the seeds. In this pot, I am placing the seeds flat side up, that is, rounded side down. And lastly, I will be planting these three seeds with the pointy end down, more in the traditional manner of planting seeds, and we'll see if it really makes any difference. Check out the seeds in the moist paper towel. They have been in the box for only one week and the seeds are already starting to germinate. I'm going to let them grow a bit longer before I transplant them into starter pots. Okay, here they are after about 10 days. Two of the three seeds have developed a lot of roots and I am going to place them all in starter containers. Here they are in their starter containers, including the one that hasn't germinated. Here's a picture of the flat side down seeds after only 10 days. These pictures are of seeds planted directly in soil after about two weeks worth of growth. They are already nice looking seedlings. Rambutan are definitely fast growers. It's been three weeks and time to evaluate our four different germination methods. I'm going to start with the least successful. This pot here had three seeds with the flat side up and only one of them successfully germinated. I'm curious as to what happened to the other two, so I'm going to try to dig them up. It looked like one started over here and then just stopped growing. I'm curious as to what happened to that one too. Interesting. I'm thinking the reason this seed did not grow properly is because some bug or insect ate the top and that prevented it from growing. It has a well-developed root system and I probably would have gotten the usual 2 out of 3 successful germination rate from this method too. In this pot I planted 3 seeds with the pointy end down. Two of the seeds germinated and we have beautiful seedlings. This method definitely works well. These are the seeds that I germinated using the moist paper towel method. Two of them germinated and did great and the third one just did not seem to grow. Two out of three, great. And here are the three seeds I planted directly in soil, flat side down. All three grew and have produced beautiful, beautiful seedlings. Eight out of 12 of our seeds germinated and have grown into beautiful seedlings. Growing fresh rambutan seeds from fresh fruit is fun and easy. The seeds germinate quickly, usually within seven to 10 days. I got an overall 66% success rate 
and I was really happy with that. Rambutan are tropical fruit, so be sure to grow your seeds in an environment where it is always above 77 degrees Fahrenheit, 25 degrees Celsius. And I believe rambutans in general are very easy to germinate and you should not have any problems no matter what method you use. If you enjoyed this video, please tick that like button and leave a comment below. Happy gardening! Be sure and check out all my gardening videos from my gardening playlist, as well as my computer tutorial videos and general interest videos. See you next time!